with the club, but I pretty much. Yeah, pretty much. But I, and I don't expect him to bet. I don't think five hundred is a bluff size. I still think it's a good fold. I just think people generally in live poker think about it a little more. But no need to Hollywood if you don't have a Hollywooding hand. But For still. Sure. Okay, here goes Jack putting the two hundred on. As I said, there it is. I sensed. Oh, now I'm too loud. Jesus. Sorry, I sensed a little uh, boredom coming from Jack. I know Jack played all day yesterday. Um, Played the full session, a lot of thinking, a lot of playing. Has a couple kids. They were up early, lost an hour of sleep due to the time change. So I think Jack is a little, uh, hey, pretty little tired today. So you know what'll wake you up is a two hundred dollars straddle. So that's his uh, move. And I expect Jack, prior to seeing his hand, to isolate so wide here when he puts on the two hundred. Hold up, hold up. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You're right. Yeah, I, I expect him to. Oh, yeah. he checks the king eight off. I kind of thought being the first. <laughs> Ooh. Wait for it. And he flops top pair king kicker, and Miss Turner flops top pair ace kicker. So it's a bit of a cooler situation for Jack. And he raises here for value, and she snap calls. So if I'm Jack, I'm when she snap calls, I. Ooh, wow. Oh, what wow, a call. the dagger. The dagger. Eight, and she leads 400. So I expect Jack to double her up here. He might call here to trap, but he's only thing he's thinking about is how do I get more money in this pot? I and with a weak lead like this, it could yeah. easily be two nines or fives or whatever, you know? Oh, my oh God. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I don't think he's putting her on an eight when she weak leads. I think he just calls to keep her in the pot, to keep exactly. her bluffs in the pot. Exactly. Or her random. And now hands. the ace is actually a good card. For Jack, because if she was bluffing with like an ace X hand, you know, now she might be in there. And so now when she bets it, it polarizes her range even more. And what I mean by that is she either has really weak hands or really strong hands, because she's never going to bet like sevens or a four on this river. So she either has an eight, an ace, a boat, or a bluff. I and think so, Jack might just put her in. Yeah, absolutely. He just goes for, no, he just goes for a small raise. He goes for 2,300 and she goes all in. Jack is sick. How much is it? And as as he Hello. should be. And when she insta shoves, it's pretty tough. But at the same time, she he beats a lot of eights. So I think like eight six is a fold. And he folds. Wow. Very unbelievable. Good fold. He snap folds. Now we're playing poker. I think that's a great. I think given the way she plays, she isn't gonna re-raise an eight. Like if she had an eight, she just calls. It probably, raise. but she's probably only jamming. Three Some people overplay boats. their hands. So that's one of the things about yeah. players that, you know, we might think like that because you think, okay, what worse hands am I going to get called with? Schombacher's repping a strong range. She can have a boat. Why would I throw out an eight? But at the same time, against unknown players that you don't know how they think, it's, you know, it's harder to fold an eight there.